The following is a demo on how to use the Aware Light Configurator to design your own study. We start by entering the basic study information. Followed by the database configuration details. This is my test server, temporary test server, the default MySQL port, the name of a fresh empty database that I've just created, and the name of a an insert only MySQL account that is going to be used by the Aware Light app. Here we provide the details of our database's root user in order to initialize things, to set up all the tables and to create this insert only account. We can initialize database. It does its thing. Success. Now we test the connection to make sure everything's working with these uh, newly created uh, entities. Done. And we move on. Create a couple of test questions if we want to do an EMA. Select the question type, just make this a free text. Add a second question. Once that's done, we can move towards uh, creating a schedule for these questions. Include both questions and say we'll set um, our system to deliver an EMA at 8 p.m. every evening. Next, we move on to activating sensors or selecting sensors and setting configuration settings. Uh, suppose we only want to upload data when the phone is connected to Wi-Fi and only when the phone is charging, clean the data weekly. Uh, we'll set foreground priority and enable settings update. This is if you want uh, participants in a study or you know users of Aware Light be able to adjust their sensor settings from within their phone. Location, for example, battery, communication. Oh, let's pick some hardware sensors. So I'll pick Bluetooth, geolocation, Wi Fi. Move on and we reach the end of our configuration journey. We will would press on the download study config button, which will generate a JSON file that you then download to your desktop, say, and get that JSON file and upload it to say an AWS S3 uh, bucket or a Google Drive so that it's web accessible. And then people with uh, Aware Light installed can point Aware Light upon installation to that URL of your config file, and Aware Light will finalize setting itself up. And just note that we do save an anonymous version of this config file without any of your database credentials. We just save it so that we, we can compile usage statistics. And that's it.